how to sell excel templates on etsy hello and welcome to our channel on this video i'm going to show you how you can sell excel templates on etsy so please watch till the end to probably understand the tutorial and to create an account on etsy you could also click my affiliate link below the description for earn a scroll commission with no additional cost to you and basing the link you may also get some discount or rewards upon sign up but before that, if you don't know what is Etsy, it is a leading global online marketplace that specializes in unique and creative goods, primarily handmade and vintage items, as well as craft supplies. Aside from that, Etsy operates on a model that allows sellers to set up personal storefronts where they list their items for a nominal fee of 20 US dollar per listing, alongside a commission on sales. And the platform emphasizes the importance of human connection in commerce aiming to keep creativity at the storefront of its operation. And Etsy continues to thrive as a community-driven marketplace that supports small businesses while promoting sustainability and responsible practices within the e-commerce space. And now, to create an account on Etsy, you could also click the link in the description, or alternatively, you could also click the sign-in button on the top right corner. And on this pop-up window, you could also simply enter here your email address, your password, or you could also continue using your Google account, Facebook, or Apple ID. And after signing in, you will be directed in this page. And as you can see, I'm currently signing in my account in here. And if you're going to go to the search bar and can search for Excel templates, it will show us all of the results in here. Some templates from Excel that is offering or selling by other sellers of users in here. So as you can see, we have here a variety of options that we can choose if we are the buyer. But since we're the seller, we could also use some of this product listing as our guide to create our own or sell our own Excel templates. And by clicking this one, for example, it will show us in here all of the product details about this kind of digital products that is offered on this Etsy. You'll see here the title, the corresponding prices, and also a piece code on right here, it will show us all of the item details, including digital downloads, the file type about this item, and the number of people who already purchased this kind of digital product. And from here, it will show us on the left side panel some of this media files of the digital product that they offer. So basically, we're going to also create this one if we're trying to sell a digital product on this platform on Etsy. And aside from that, below here, it will show you the same kind of products, such as Excel templates that you could also use as your guide in selling your own templates in here. But to create our own template, you simply open our Excel application. And from here, we can simply navigate to customize or start creating a template using the tools on the top panel, the beer home, insert, page layout, formulas, and many more. And from insert, you could also insert your table if you want to, an illustration, a graph, and other graphical representation in here depending on your preferences, or depending on what kind of templates you want to create. You could also see here the formulas, the page layout. So basically, from here you can simply create your own design depending on your preferences. Now at this point, I already created my own design template under this sheet tool in here. So this is basically an average create calculator where if a customer tries to purchase this, they can simply calculate their academic average or their QPI without needing to use the calculator. But at this point, we're going to enter here a formula. For example, this one, by clicking, entering here also equal and entering average. And after that, they select all of this data and click enter to proceed. And as you can see, it has now been average, seeing the data on the first sem read. So just simply apply it on the next column if you want to. And also do the same process on this average right here by clicking or entering equal average. Then selecting the data that you want to be average here. And after that, just simply apply it on the same row that you prefer. So as you can see, I just successfully create an average quick calculator template, but that is just only a simple so you can do your own kind of template in here using your Excel application. And if you're now done, you can simply screenshot this one in which the screenshot photo will be used to input in our media files to start selling on Etsy. And to save this, just click the file option at the top left corner and click the save as to proceed. Then you can enter here the file name that you want. For example, I'm going to enter here Excel template for grid monitoring and by clicking the save button it will automatically save to your computer files. And now that we successfully create our own template on Excel, we can now proceed by going back in our Etsy.com and on the top right corner, just click the shop manager and you will be directed on this page. 
So all you need to do is simply fill out all of this required information starting to the shop preferences. From here, all you need to do is simply select your shop language, which is English in here, and also your shop country and shop currency. And after that, just click the save and continue button to proceed to the next step. Now from here under name your shop, just simply enter here the name of your shop, which between 4 to 20 characters, no special character or spaces should be included in here. And after that, just click the save and continue button below to proceed again. Now at this point under this, stop your shop. Then you select here the category and what type of item list that you create. So just simply enter here these digital files and answer the question I made it. I'm going to click I did. And what is it? I'm going to click a supply or tool to make these. And when was it made? I'm going to select the year 2020 to 2024. And it is created by me. Now moving on, just proceed by clicking the save and continue button to proceed here. But make sure that you also fill out all of the required information, such as CPI web production partners and many more. But again, under this part or category, simply enter here the category of your listing in order to save the changes. So I'm going to enter here Excel templates and just click the templates under salt in here. Then again, just click the save and continue button to proceed to the next step. And upon clicking this one, will automatically be directed on this page. And all we need to do is to simply fill out all of this required information, such as about pricing inventory variations and many more. Now starting to this title. For instance, I'm going to enter here the title Excel template for grade monitoring. So basically from here you can include the keywords that buyers would use to search for this item. And after that, since we screenshot one of our files that we created, you can simply upload it in here. Since this is what the customer will see if they try to click the media files in our listing. So as you can see, I've now successfully added the photo in here. But you could also make it more creative if you want to, since it will serve as your thumbnail also. Now moving on below here, just simply enter here or upload the file, which is the digital files that we just saved earlier. But at this point, I'm going to enter or add the files on this moment. And below here, you could also even add a description to describe your template. And even under this price inventory, just enter here the price, for example, I'm going to enter. Then US dollar, whoever it will show you that it has an estimated fees. And for the quantity, I'm going to enter here. 999 but if you want to make it a limited edition you could also simply enter here a limited stock which is 99 and add to description limited edition template now moving on aside from that below here you could also add here attacks in attributes such as the primary color secondary color and many more and even the tags in here and the materials that you use so now after filling out all of the record information you can proceed by clicking the save and continue button in here but make sure that you also fill out all of the required information in here before proceeding to the next step. Since the next step in here is to simply link your payment methods and share your billing info. And after that, you will now be successfully creating a listing like you can find in this one. So this is basically what your products look like upon publishing it and filling out all of the required information to set up your listing. And aside from that, you could also navigate some other options on the top right corner such as your purchases and reviews, your special offers, account settings, and many more. But overall, that is just basically how you can sell Excel templates on Etsy. Thank you.